Hey, what's going on, everybody? Hey, Skim with Ralph Cole here. First of all, I do want to apologize. I just woke up, just hopped out the bed. I ain't brushed my teeth yet. I ain't do my skincare routine yet. My bad. I ain't tell myself I love myself yet. But, uh, so I do apologize for that. But I do want to, um, you know, take this video. And as, as you can see, you know, it's not edited or nothing like that, which is cool. I don't care. Um... I just got off the phone with my mom, and uh, you know I'm, I'm I'm planning on moving to North Carolina to Charlotte, so that you know I can uh, be with my daughter and everything. Cause that's where she lives at right now. I'm living in uh, in Tacoma or Seattle for the people that don't know what Tacoma is. But um, you know, planning on moving to Charlotte so that I can you know begin my new career there and like you know be there with my daughter and everything so my daughter can have me and I can have her and we can be there with each other so and also too so that you know my daughter can have both parents within a close uh close range but you know the biggest thing that I was thinking about is that you know when I do move I'm pretty much like sacrificing everything that I've built up since I've been here especially like with my barbering and you know everything that I've done. You know I'm, I'm sacrificing it all to go there and start completely over. But I was thinking about it. And I'm like, man, like that would be the perfect time for me to do it because, being that I'm going there and my daughter's gonna be with me, that's gonna allow her to actually see what it takes to start from scratch, like actually have nothing and build it into whatever it is that you want to build it into. And I think that's a great thing for her to see. My daughter is six right now, six years old. So by the time I get out there, she'll be seven. And I feel like by the age of seven, if she sees that, you know, okay, I'm with my dad all the time. You know, here's what he created. Here's, you know, here's, here's his vision on what it is that he wants, what it is that he's trying to achieve. And I'm gonna, you know, teach my daughter the, the the process of how to create a successful business and of course I'm gonna need help because you know for me I'm a workaholic to where I can do all of the leg work but as far as all the paperwork and all of the extra stuff that comes with you know being a business owner and stuff like that I still need help on myself you know even with the business that I got now I'm behind on a lot of stuff you know it is what it is I'm nowhere near perfect you know but uh, I feel like that's a great thing to teach my daughter and also allow my daughter to uh, to become an a entrepreneur at a young age herself and create her own brand in order for her to brand herself into having, like being able to have a platform that she can express herself. You get what I'm saying? Every, anything that she want to do is it'll all be underneath her own brand whether it's uh you know her finger painting whether it's uh actually the other yesterday i was talking to our facetiming and uh i asked her i said i said baby what you what you how do you feel about you know me and you learning how to play the piano at the same time and she said she want to do it and i think that that'll be something that's dope because that's something that me and her can you know have together and we can challenge each other on but the biggest thing with what I'm trying to do with that is have it to where I'm trying to learn how to play the piano myself because I love music. But what that does for her is she can take everything that she's learning and challenge herself at a young age to where by the time she does get to you know her teenage years or something like that, she has this. You get what I'm saying? And I can show her what it is that she can do with it in order for her to you know create whatever it is that she want to create whether it's you know her wanting to you know now take on singing lessons whether she just want to go into you know classical music whether or whether she just want to do youtube you know videos of her doing you know covers of different songs and everything but it'll still all be underneath her brand you get what i'm saying even with her uh, finger painting i told her i told her that you know i'm gonna I'm a, you know get into finger painting you know, uh, you know, once again, still underneath her own brand to where she's recording herself doing the finger painting, 
you know, she's talking about what it is that she's painting and what it means to her. And then I'm going to even, you know, introduce us to going to, you know, uh, art shows and everything like that to what now, you know, her own paintings, people buying her original paintings for $500, you know, and all that money would be going to her to what she can, you know, rotate the money right back into her own brand. You know, those are things that I want to teach my daughter. Right now, I'm 27. I'll be 28 in June. But what I'm trying to do is create a foundation and create a platform to where by the time my daughter turns 28 or 27, she's already way past where I'm at right now in my life. You know what I'm saying? To where she'll, she would have been, became a millionaire by the time she's 28 or 27. You know what I'm saying? Because of the things that I've taught her. You know what I'm saying? To what, like, it's not even me, uh, you know, trying to tell her what to do or anything like that, but, you know, allowing herself to, you know, create whatever it is that she want to create. You know, I don't, you know, even if she don't want to go to college, that's fine. Maybe you don't have to go to college. You know, if you want to be a CEO of your own company, Let's figure out how to do it. Let's figure out what it is that you want to do, what your uh, company is, and everything. And let's let's figure out how to make it happen. Let's get you a little team together. Let's make it happen. You know, and they'll all be for her. You know, of course, for me, you know, I'm I'm trying to build uh, I'm trying to build my brand from the ground up. The skin with Ralph Cole brand. And, uh, you know, it ain't no telling the, the leaps and bounds that I can create within that in order for that to, you know, turn into something that'll be huge, you know? It ain't no telling. I don't, I don't know what's about to happen. I just know that I definitely do want it to be successful. But, you know, this is an industry that, uh, that I'm new to. It's an industry that I still have to learn about. You know, I did just graduate from my master esthetician program, which I did learn a lot, but it's still so much for me to learn. And yes, I am a barber right now, but going into the aesthetics world, it's a whole different thing. It's a whole different thing. And I'm definitely excited about learning, learning the uh, new industry and actually going into it because it's something that's new, it's something refreshing. So that's, that's definitely uh, what I want to give to the people. Uh, I'm definitely going to start going hard, hear more on my YouTube. Um, hopefully I can have it to it by the time I uh, move to Charlotte. You know, I got, I got, you know, I got a little, a little paycheck that's, that's, they'll be coming from my YouTube, hopefully. So then by the time I get there, you know, I don't have to do anything except for, you know, work from home and just focus on my YouTube, putting out content. I know I still have so much more content to put out, but, you know, it is what it is. You have to start from somewhere. I feel like a lot of people think that when you first start out with uh, uploading content or even building a brand, everything has to be perfect from the beginning, which it doesn't. It doesn't. You know, whatever, whatever idea it is that you got, put it out you know what I'm saying the people that's gonna grow with you they're gonna grow with you people want to see you grow people want to see the transition of you going from not knowing where it is that you want to go or not or not even knowing how to properly edit videos or you know uh, not knowing how to properly like uh, you know edit your audio so your audio can be on point and everything but you know, people want to see that growth to when, okay, now he understands how to, uh, he or she understands how to edit videos. Now he or she understands uh, how to stabilize your audio so that it won't be like hot or, you know, making people, uh, speakers pop or something like that. But, um, but yeah, I don't know. I'm just, I'm just driving right now. It's just what was on my mind. And I feel like I'm going to start doing these. Uh, brain dumps more often more often you know I want my videos not to be about me I want my videos to be for other people to watch it and for other people to get motivated or encourage other people to actually start doing whatever it is that they want to do you know 
to come to my page and get the motivation for you to see, okay, you know what, I been had this idea and I want to do it. And because Ralph told me to do it, that's why I do it. You know? Do you. Do, be, the, be the best you that you can be at the end of the day. That's all I want from you. You know? If you watch this video, leave a like. You know, help support me so we can support each other. I, it'll, it'll, I look at it like this. It'll be a lot easier for me to post content if you support me. If you watch the video, just press the like button. Press the subscribe button. It takes, it takes less than a second to do. Press the like button. Press the, press the subscribe button. And press the little bell right next to the uh, subscribe button too so that you know whenever I do post something, you can see it. But everybody have a good day. Everybody be blessed. Everybody stay safe. I can't tell you to stay in the house because I'm out, I'm outside the house right now. I needed to get out, man. I'm going crazy. I got bags. You see that? I got bags underneath my eyes. That's work. <laughs>